Sally. Um, some of the Yankee Candle parts and the sales that Yankee Candle will be coming up with. And a new little power that I've just discovered that I have. This is the Yankee Candle Autumn Leaves Fragrance. It's my favorite scent from Yankee Candles. And I will set this on fire without a lighter. Ready? One, two, three. Cool, huh? I love it. It's great. Don't need to mess around with matches or anything. It's awesome. Um, but really though, it's just special effects is amazing. Gotta love it. Speaking of, I'm actually getting my own camera. Right now I'm getting a camera and a cameraman. My grandfather's helping me make this, which is awesome. So thank you very much to him. And the thing with the great thing I love about tarts and tart burners is that you can melt, depending on how big they are, up to like three to four different tarts, or three different scents, or as many as you can make. And it's kind of confusing what combos people would think would smell good together and what wouldn't smell good together. So I had um, the coupon that they have right now going around, the one for the one dollar for tarts and, and um, little votive samples. And I know that the actual sale at the store where you don't need the coupon is coming up. It's April 5th through the 15th, so that's a good 10 days to just go and stock up. So uh, just some ideas for combos that, we, that I have that I think would smell good. And you can write your favorite combos down in the, combo, the comment box. And the first combo I have, I don't have any particular QT names for this or anything right now. I know like um, when you go to Yankee Candles you can get a sheet and it has the name and the tarts it used to make that. I haven't had one of those sheets in quite a while. I don't know if this is anything that they already have. But this is something that when I went I picked them up and I thought they'd smell good together. So uh, combo number one I have is Drift Away. Which smells a lot like a um, river kind of hiking in the woods. And then Log Cabin which I thought would be a great combo. And then I have Wedding Day and True Rose as combo number two. And then the next one I have, which I'm excited to see how this one would smell, is Stormwatch and Rainbow's End. And then the other one is going to be Willow Breeze and Meadow Mist, which is one that I've never had before, so that's going to be new. And the last one is going to be Sun and Sand and Garden Hideaway. Never burned these together before. I don't really know how it's going to smell. I'm interested. It's just a little experiment. Let me know if you want any um, reviews or if you have any that you would like or don't like or anything like that. And what do you think of the new Sense of Inky Candles been coming out? would be a good thing to post in the comment box. Um, lately I have been doing... Um, Candles by Victoria reviews for individual reviews for what I burned that day and I'm not sure how I feel about doing that. I've been noticing that there have been videos for what I burned this week and top five and all those things. I'm thinking maybe doing one of those at an unboxing first impressions kind of video. Um, don't really know where I'm going to go with this. Just leave your comments in the comment box and let me know. So thank you so much for watching my video. Hope you have a good day and night wherever you are. Hope to talk to you soon.